King Charles III's coronation? Yes. So his now his May schedule has not been solidified. It's not been released. But people at the White House sources are saying they don't anticipate he'll go. Mark, I didn't realize there's like beef with the Biden family and and the English. They're 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 Irish Americans that apparently have some real beef there with with the English. And his mother once allegedly refused to sleep in a bed because Queen Elizabeth had slept in there before. I think it's probably old age for the reason he won't come, or maybe it's because he didn't like his seat at Queen Elizabeth's, you know, funeral, because uh, he was kind of put in the, he was put further than Harry and Meghan. Um, but perhaps uh, he might not be attending the coronation. Would any of us miss him? I don't know. But it, I'm it not is sure we would. We uh, many of my viewers and listeners will not recognize the name, but Ron DeSantis could be the next U.S. president. Who is he? And tell me more. Oh, they will recognize the name because, like, Kinsey and Mark are the Ron DeSantis Trump? fan club. I, That's from what, true. From what I can tell. Well, we he's, talk about he, Ron a lot. He's the governor of Florida, and he's really one of Trump's biggest competitors when it comes to the 2024 um, presidential season. We're going to see him go head to head with Trump. Um, he Trump calls him Ron De Sanctimonious. He's got a couple of nicknames for him. He's already throwing punches. Um, but, you know, Ron DeSantis, I think, is a, a pretty strong candidate for president in, in 2024 because he is anti-woke mm -hmm. and very tough on, you know, he's very tough on crime. He's tough on everything that is common sense that seems to be lacking in some of the, the Democratic states here in, in America.